Hey, Brian. CP. Hi. So it's that time of year again. Yeah. We try to put together this anniversary right. thing maybe again this year. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, go on. Tea or coffee? Uh, or coffee. Yeah. All right. All right. Oh, hey. Yeah, yeah. I've got decaf. No, 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 I'll just, I'll just have a decaf. Oh, I'll have a decaf. oh actually, <coughs> I'll have a proper one. Have it out of the. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Grind some beans up. Yeah, I will. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Yeah. But decaf. D decaf, yeah. yeah. Any flavoured stuff? No, 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 no. I'm, yeah, I'm trying to, trying to watch me. Yeah, do you want yeah. a big one? Uh, yeah, yeah. Do get, use that cup with the, um, the, oh, the big yeah. elephant on it. Yeah. The massive cup. Yeah, with the nose. All right, yeah. All right. Cheers, oh, babe, babe, babe. Yeah. Um, just, uh, just avoid the Kenko stuff because I'm not really, yeah. not really down with that at the moment. Yeah. All right. Don't yeah. yeah. Okay. All right. Don't want to go there. No, 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 no. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Well, you see other stuff then. Yeah. All right. Okay. Are you sure you want coffee though? I, I was well, going to make coffee. What tea have we got? Have we got Red Bush? I was going to make a pet. Let's finish. No, I like, I like to have something to eat first before I have a cup of milk. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Oh, cheers. It's good. Yeah. Go on. Crack out the bourbons. All right. All right. Cheers, love. Thanks. Oh, babe, babe. Yeah. <coughs> if you're going to do his bourbons, I will have a peppermint. Just a, just a regular tea. No, no, no. Go, go, go for peppermint. Yeah, yeah. Okay. All right. Cheers, love. Yeah. Cheers. Right. Babe. Actually, what time are you doing dinner? Well, about 20 minutes, probably. <sighs> I'll start in about 20 minutes, but it'll be like... Be I'll leave the bourbons. Yeah, leave the bourbons, time. yeah. Go back to the decaf. Coffee. Yeah, yeah please. Yeah, in the elephant Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Cheers, love. Yeah. Thank you. Can you at least just say something? <sighs> are you offended or not there? Yeah, CP, yeah, um, yeah, I'm not going to, to be honest, nah, well, well I would, but I, I just don't want to. Oh. Okay, yeah, all right, mate, nice one. Well, G nice speaking to you. Thanks. Good, good to, good, good to chat. Cool. See ya. Hey, maybe did you want to try? <sighs> the religious one said no. <laughs> If there's ever somebody who's going to come through. Look at this bitch. Oh, CP. Hey, what's up, CP? How are you doing, buddy? Hey, Lee. Uh, it's my anniversary coming up. Is it the time again? Your anniversary's coming up? Oh, cool. Yeah, so what, what's up? What's going on? Any chance of you doing me a solid and being a part of the video? No, no. Um, no, fuck that. I would rather film six trailer reactions in a row, to be honest. I still love seeing you in your short jean shorts. So if you could keep sending me those pics, that would be fantastic. Hello? CP, how's it going, man? It's Luke. Remember me? <laughs> oh, hi, Luke. How's it going? Yeah, it's going good. I just uh, woke up this morning and uh, had a little uh, look at my subscription feed and uh, saw that you put up a little uh, teaser for an anniversary video. Yeah. And? And I just thought that maybe you... Want to ask me to do it? Oh, for fuck's sake. Relax. Relax? Relax. I'm as cool as a cucumber. I don't know what you're talking about, mate. Look, I just got a, I just got a question for you. That's all. Related to this whole anniversary ego stroke fest thing. Do you have any guests lined up for this video this year? Oh, uh, 
Yeah, quite a few. Quite a few, yeah, I thought so. Mm. Oh no, it's just interesting. It's really interesting how a year ago, I was the only fucker to turn up for your anniversary video back when you were living in Switzerland with Donald or whatever the fuck. And now that you've flown to the other side of the world, now that you're actually living back in New York, you couldn't care less about me. You couldn't give me a call, off me an invite to do this video. No, you couldn't, could you? I saw on the tears you had some chick in there as well. You all loved up. That's all fine and dandy. But do you know what? I always knew a woman was going to come between us. Wait, wait, did you just say chick? Chick. Girl. Woman, whatever you want to call her. Wait, 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 what do you mean by that? I don't know what I meant by that. Look, if you're gonna ask me, or if you're gonna ask me now because you feel bad, forget it, I'm not doing it, I'm not interested, I've got better things to do, I've got bigger fish to fry, and quite frankly, it's wasting my time just talking to you right now. So you should just sit down, have a long, hard think about what you've done, and I'm gonna make like a Snoke and leave. See ya. Man, and this guy says he has no ego. Split. The fuck am I gonna do? Okay, let's do this. Can't be talking to everybody all the time. Hello? Uh, uh, oh, hi, CP. <laughs> Guess who? Dennis? <laughs> who, me? No, 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 no. Uh, I'm I'm just calling to see if there's any new updates. Update? What do you think? The passport. Yeah, well, I'm still being tortured by the UK. Uh, well, I, I was just curious about if there was an ETA on when you would be able to come and pick up the rest of your stuff. Yeah, I know. I've been looking for my wig, too. Yeah, 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 yeah. I know, I, I know. There's nothing either one of us can do. Oh, hey, did you think about my, uh... Your anniversary video? No, no, I, I forgot all about that. Well, well, why? Can't I just say happy anniversary to you like this? You know I don't like to be on camera. <laughs> I don't, I don't get it. I lived with you for almost a year. Come down, come down. Okay, fine. I'll see if I can't record something. Thank you, but just so you know, it's got to be by the end of the week. Yeah, yeah, before the week's over. Like I said, come down. So, yeah. Have a day. Peace out. I guess. Hey, Roger. <laughs> guess who? Uh, yeah, uh, I'm afraid I got some bad news for you. I just talked to CP and they still have his passport and he doesn't know when he can come and pick up the rest of his crap. So yeah, like I said, I got some bad news. I won't have a spare bedroom anytime soon. It, well, don't blame me! Blame CP! It's, it's not my crap. <laughs> yeah. Well, he, he he do have a few nice steel books lying around here <laughs> that I don't have in my collection. So I wonder what he remembers is still here in Denmark. <laughs> yeah, you're right. It is CP we're talking about. He doesn't remember jack shit. <laughs> so uh, yeah, I. I I guess I could do that. Getting bare in the cupboard here. Hey, Ryan, do you think that maybe you can try? No. Just kidding? Yeah, get it, get it, and, and okay, get, yes, that's what I'm talking about. What is who's calling me right now? Hello, Lindsay. Whoa. Hi, CP. What are you up to? Nothing. Nah, I'm just, just chilling. Hey, can I ask a favor? Oh, you want me to? Oh, um, yeah, just uh, oh, um, uh, you know what? Hold on one second. Yeah, it's Serpy. I would love to do whatever it was you wanted me to do.
I simply love to make stupid shite for you. Cough, cough. Oh no. The doctors told me if my cough came back I would die. What a cruel world. Cough, cough. My only regret in life was not getting to do whatever it was Serpy wanted me to do. Goodbye cough hack. Cough cough die. Yeah. Well, feel better? Nobody puts baby in the corner. Goddamn right nobody puts baby in the corner. <gasps> Hello? Hey, Cody. Uh, Cody's not available right now. Please leave your message at the sound of the beep. Beep. Okay, uh, hey, Cody, it's CP from, uh, like, Reviews. Um, so I have this thing coming up where, uh, I do a, a video every year for my anniversary. And considering the fact that you're one of the newer YouTubers that I'm friends with over the last year, it'd be nice to have some sort of representation of 2017. It's, it's not that big a deal. I just want to you know, maybe show the world that, you know, no matter how much you still might leave, we're, we're still okay. Something like that. You know, just, just a, a good sign just to say that, you know, no matter, despite what it looks like, we're, we're, we're What the fuck? I'm getting down to the bottom of this bullshit right now. Hey, Lee, did you give that motherfucker my number? Well, he just called me. He didn't just get it out of the fucking blue, did he? You're the only one who's got it on YouTube. I blame you. I knew it. I fucking knew you did it. I know we agreed that the jean shorts pictures were worth it, but dude, we got to draw the line somewhere. We already let the guy on our stream once a month. I mean, where does it end? Do we have to? Do we have to? There's no other way. Fine, fine, I'll play ball. But don't give my number to anybody else, all right? Especially Lomax. That guy fucking creeps me out whenever he starts yelling. All right, I'll talk to you later. Fucking hello one, hello all my ass. No, I will not help you with your fucking anniversary video. I'm wearing makeup. Three years. What a fucking three years it's been, huh? Woo. Hello one, hello all, welcome to my three year anniversary. Um, a very special thank you to the people who didn't take part in this video. <clears throat> um, yeah, so if you've followed the journey of Will I Like It reviews, if you've been a part of the subscriber base for the three years, three years plus now at this point, um, you'll easily recognize that 2015, 2016, and 2017 are all very different years. Um, 2015 was a year that I mostly focused on doing straight Will I Like It style reviews where <clears throat> regardless of how I felt about the movie, the, the, the primary goal was making sure to find an audience for whatever it was I was reviewing. And in that period I was reviewing three, sometimes four movies a week, um, slow weeks. It was, it was at least one. I, I had a pretty steady schedule and, um, yeah, it was, it was, I don't want to call it successful. Uh, there's, you know, a couple, it, 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 it was rare for those videos not to hit a thousand views. Um, quite common around 13, 1500. Sometimes one would hit two, three. There was a couple that hit five or six. Um, but yeah, I was, I was doing the movie reviewer game and if I'm being brutally honest, it, 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 
it was, um, you know, something to distract me from something else, which shows up later in the, the timeline. Uh, towards the end of 2015, I started to kind of branch out and use my comedy background, and I did a, a roast or two. Um, by the end of 2015, I think I had done two or three roasts. The Schmoes No was, was one of the larger ones. Um, later on, I did Chris Stuckman. Uh, which was, he himself commented on that, um, other than making a note that my ignorance was a little bit too much on something that I mentioned, he had nothing but glowing things to say about it. So it was, it was kind of uh, a shift at that point where I was like, all right, maybe, maybe we should kind of not completely pivot, but branch a bit. And then... And then personal life took over, and uh, for all of 2016, I, I had a quite a bit of uncertainty on this channel. My personal life was flipped upside down. I, I didn't know where I was going to go. I didn't know where I was going to be. Uh, went through the early stages of a divorce. Um, and then I, uh, you know, th the first two or three months of 2016 were were somewhat resemble old old school. Will I like it reviews? And then I filled a request for a roast, um, the good old situation. That, that was probably the, the, the big red line in the sand that you can point to and say, oh, that was probably where it started taking a really unfortunate turn. Um, I think between that time and like four months later, I think I lost 1200 subscribers and stragglers oh wait uh, you might not hear this <clears throat> and quite a few stragglers over the course of time as my content just disintegrated um 2016 was a weird year uh, a lot of streams um that you know the one thing that that i tried keeping up with that you know it was it was a losing battle Lee over at Drum Dums, we were doing a series, Hard Needs a Hero. We were doing that together. That started in 2015. Uh, we kept trying to get that going through 2016, where it wasn't quite as normal. Um, and that's, that's only my fault. Um, there are people that, that were ginormous through, through the stages of CP disintegration. People like Brian Lomax, Lee, of course, Drum Dums. Dennis, who we'll mention again in a second, uh, Roger, Channel Dawnstar, Peter, Bearded Movie Guy, Luke, Razor Wire Reviews, Ryan, Ryan Chataway, Lindsay, uh, My Two Cents of Nonsense, uh, Bob over at Organized Chaos. Those two guys probably are the, like, the bookends as far as your, if there's a trivia question of the history of Will I Like It Reviews, who were the first two and stuck around the longest. Those two are the first two like door opening as far as community members that, that have been around the longest. <clears throat> um, but yeah, it, it, 2016, it, the, the first half wasn't as bad, but it, it wasn't good. And the, the content really started to suffer. I would say somewhere in the summer at that point, I, was, I, I had no idea what, where I was going, what I was doing. Uh, the financial situation was a mess. I, I was full, full blown depression. Um, and then by the fall, autumn of 2016, uh, Dennis, who was formerly known as the Blue Corner, uh, sent out a, a helping hand. And uh, I was to, to completely transplant and stay in Denmark for what, what was supposed to be a permanent basis. Um, so, Staying there at the very end of 2016, I did another roast. Uh, Dennis and I did a couple of like, not, not will I like it review style reviews. We did kind of like a, a vloggy type thing. And that was pretty much it, how we closed out 16. Uh, the roast itself was, was, was quite okay. But again, I, I, I think if, if you were to point at my channel and say he was his best when, the last couple of months of 2015, I was really proud of the content that I was putting out then. That's a fucking long time ago now. 
Um, but yeah, 2017, I, I was completely, fully immersed and in Denmark at that point. A visitor, I, I was I was a guest in somebody else's house, which is, it's difficult to do things like that. I, it, it, 2016, I thought it was a little uncomfortable because, you know, I'm on one floor and uh, the ex-wife-to-be is on the other. Uh, you think you have independence and, and you don't, but then... When you're a guest in somebody else's house, then do you really understand that you don't have independence? And you know, it's it's just uh, it's just part of the process. Uh, my content, I don't know if it's suffered. It's, it's not like nobody told me not to film. It's just I felt a little weird taking liberties. Um, there'd be times where I'd I'd wait for nobody to be home, and uh, you know that's that's not the best way to plan. Um, yeah, but uh, the content came out. I, I slowly introduced Savage Cinema, which is which is some stuff in in the the 2016 2017 uh, timeline of will I like it reviews. That that's some of the stuff I would say is um, okay, good, not not my best, but certainly not not par with the underperformance that I had been doing. Um, yeah, and over the course of 2017, met a a, a female, a, a UK resident, Emily, uh, Emily's Adventures in Horrorland, who, who is currently with me. Uh, that that relationship developed from from an interview, uh, and just a, I don't remember how it how it conjured up so so quickly or whatever. But I mean, you, you go back on the channel, you could kind of see it developing for yourself. But yeah, another, see, so uh, the thing about this channel is as much as the channel from 2016 through 2017 was kind of Drek-ish, um, I at least had a bunch of important people that I could say I leaned on and made my life uh, better. I mean, 16 and 17 were, were, for at least the first half, first two thirds of 17, really, really heavily depressed. Uh, I, I don't think I would be able to get over that without some place to just chill out and relax. That I have, I have, I have to owe that to Dennis. Uh, I didn't have to worry about much other than uh, keeping the door open, which was such a, a weird, uh, in Denmark, nobody shuts their doors. And uh, apparently me shutting my door was a bit offensive. That, that was the one thing that, that I kind of got you know questioned about that was the only thing that was really a big deal but uh, I, I was able to heal mentally in that environment uh, people like Dennis people like Luke people like Brian people like Peter people like Lee uh, eventually people like Emily who were who fulfilled a void that wasn't around for I could say I was divorced and, and pretty much done for two years, but she filled a void that probably wasn't around for eight, eight years, if I'm being blunt. Um, and eventually I had to head back to America due to uh, the United Kingdom, believe it or not. United Kingdom didn't want me in their country. They, they kicked me out. They, I, was, I was detained for a nine hour period because I was doing too much traveling in Europe. The truth is I was just going back and forth to Denmark, but I had incorrect information um, and the United Kingdom didn't like that. So they got me in trouble. So I had to head back home. There was a couple things I had to take care of back here anyway. Um, so I went from being a guest in a, a Danish house to being a guest in my mother's house which I could at least say my content was floating. You know, not, not being successful, not, not exceeding expectation. It was floating in Denmark. Um, the three months I was at my mother's house, the content just wasn't there. Um, yeah, that, that, that's not a creative environment I was in, but as of January 1st, 2018, I am here. I am here in this current environment. Don't know how long. It's, it's at least a temporary long-term status. Um, Emily is here with me for as long as she possibly can be. Uh, this is her background. She's adopted the room. 
um, and you could, I think you could slowly see, I, I, I'm, not, I'm not completely proud of the process just yet, but uh, we're getting there. I don't know if you can hear that, but it's, it's lunchtime for the fire department. I'll wait. I've all, I have all day. No. <clears throat> so as far as the, the hundreds upon thousands of you and the dozens of you that watch the videos, um, I, I'm here to tell you that, that not only a thank you, thank you for staying subbed. I don't know how many of you are just subbed and just doing me a favor by subbing, but I, um, those of you who watch that, so something has happened to my card. I will continue to talk. That's it. You just heard it click. My camera says no more. It's done. Um, those of you who have stuck around through all this, thank you. Uh, I, I'm trying my best to get back to, uh, I want to call it November, December of 2015 style. Uh, well, I like it reviews content. Um, Emily certainly is, is somebody who's as creative as they come. It's, it's a nice little fire to light under my ass. Um, I think we bring a little bit out of each other creatively and it'll be quite exciting to see what we can do together in spite of each other, uh, whatever. But um, my content should be coming back to some sort of regularity, some sort of level of me being proud of it. Um, once again, I cannot say thank you enough to all the people in the community. That, that's really the most important part through all of this. All the people that I've met, all the incredible relationships I've made, um, that, that is what really drives me. That, that's what you know, makes me wake up in the morning and check a YouTube page. I, don't, I really don't care about fucking cat videos and things like that, but you know, I wanna know what's going on with, with so-and-so and, and what's his face and what's her tits and what's his cock and, and all that. I, I really do. I, I'm, I'm interested in, in the various relationships I've made. And most importantly, uh, the people who are patrons on my channel, people like Lindsay, who's been a patron for over a year, Ryan, who's just coming up on a year, uh, Chad Arms, WrestleManiac, 11.30, M4 Movies, uh, Man vs. Film. Like, I, I, to say thank you is, is, they're just not strong enough words. The fact that, that you think enough of me to support me is, is just thoroughly, thoroughly flattering. And I really hope I get to earn whatever it is you think is worth that money. Money. Um, but that's it for this year. Hopefully, hopefully there won't be too much change between now and 2019. Um, but I'm, I'm going to try my best to make 2018 the strongest year in at least 700 days. Um, so for the rest of my channel, for the rest of the people that you've seen on this channel, I can't wait to see who else comes. Um, have a day, have a year.